Hello all, welcome back and uh, this is Navin from UI Brains. So in this video, we are going to discuss about uh, the switch statement. So as we discussed, the switch statement is actually the alternate to the if else and is more performance than if else. So let's understand uh, an example on switch statement. So switch statement syntax is quite different than if else. So what I do is, yeah, let's start here only. Switch statements. Uh, let's take let uh, data or uh, let's take day is equal to new data dot get day. Uh, what I'm just taking is new data. I'm just creating a data object. We'll see what is data object in the future classes. Uh, dot to get day is actually function again functions concept we'll see in the next uh, future classes uh, what i'm doing is i'm creating a data object dot get day one function i'm calling so the result of day will be the day of uh, today okay so let's take a console log first if i say console dot log of day i save it so when you go and check so day is one uh, what is this day one is actually today today is Monday okay so April 20 Monday so here day is coming as one so it's not coming actually the day as Monday Tuesday what not like that it's just coming as a number uh, because in Java JavaScript they have written Sunday starts with zero it starts with zero okay Sunday is zero uh, Monday 1, Tuesday 2, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Saturday will be last 6. Uh, so the numbers will be there. But I want to print not 1, 2, 3, 4. I want to print um, the Monday, Tuesday. So how is possible is you can go with the switch case or if else. If else how you write? You will write if, if the day is equal to 0 then Sunday. Else if is equal to 1 then it's gonna be the Monday so like that you will make up to the 6 6 will be the Saturday you're gonna make in this way uh, or else or else you can use a switch statement so how to use switch statement is um, here I'll do one thing let today is equal to this empty or let's take um, okay okay page so I'll do a switch I'm writing switch syntax so you will take the day so inside you will take something called case uh, matching value so case uh, 0 okay so if the day value is matched with 0 then today value is going to be the Monday and then you must have to write something called break Okay, break statements. So like that, you have to make multiple. So okay. Uh, so if it is one, I'll make it as Tuesday. Um, actually, sorry, I've made a mistake. It is Sunday. Zero is for Sunday, right? And one is for Monday. And uh, two is for Tuesday and three is for uh, Wednesday and four is for Thursday Thursday and five is for the Friday and the six is for Saturday and same way you have a else case not this one not required same like if else else if else if else if like this lastly else case so here we have else case is default so monday is enter a proper day okay and uh, so done uh, this how the syntax looks of switch statement finally i write console.log of backtick backtick today it's not single quotes backtick okay today is i write dollar today so now check the answer 
you get it is Monday. So today is Monday. Now, um, if you want to check other one, so if day value is zero, so today you execute how many number of times it will be Monday only. If you execute on Tuesday, you get the answer as Tuesday, but I don't want to wait for you to uh, test this for Tuesday or Wednesday. You can hijack this, you can reassign day is equal to zero. If the day value is zero, here value is one, right? But here value is, uh, I mean, reassign with zero. If value is zero, answer will be Sunday. Okay, if the value one, value will be Monday. And if it is six, you get the answer is Saturday. If I say seven, you get the answer is enter a proper day. Okay, this is how we will test it. But I don't want to hijack like this because uh, I want to get that automatically from the JavaScript itself whenever you are executing. So I got the answer today is Monday. So you can please check when you are executing and how it behaves. Okay. So this is the switch statement. And what exactly the difference between if else and switches? So if else statement, uh, even though the false case, it will execute from uh, one after the other. And finally, it will reach us the actual case and it executes okay but switch statement uh, is slight different it will not execute one after the other it will never execute the false case it will directly jump to the actual case which is correct one is a true one okay it means it will not check sunday non day tuesday wednesday it won't check but it will directly jump to the uh, actual one okay and then uh, it executes so this is how uh, switch statement works. If you want to understand the flow of execution of this program. So let's see the JavaScript debugging in the next video. So then you understand clearly how it happens. Okay. So thank you so much for watching. And in the next video, we'll see JavaScript debugging. Thank you.